the most magnificent piece in all of history. Yeah. People are like, okay, so what are you talking about? Because everybody that's sitting there took your pictures and stuff like that. And I said, no, I said, this is what makes it so important. His name is inscripted. Yeah. I said, I said, look at his name. And I broke down his name. Yes. And I told him exactly what it means and everything. People were astounded. So I'm standing there talking to them, explaining who this Nasut Bitty was. Yes. And and then everything it went from a, a, this particular level to a higher level. Now. Mm-hmm. People were excited. They started crowding around. I started, I wish I had two pictures there. I mean, I got you know people standing around like crowding, I'm meeting them around, explaining this to them. Yes, yes. And I said, you need to understand this is this is limestone. This is this is carved, magnificent. Talking about who this Nasut Bitty was and what he did. Mm-hmm. Okay, so. People say, I didn't realize that it was so big, but when you see it in person, it's a whole different thing than looking at pictures. Yeah, yeah, I would imagine so. Yeah, it, imagine it is so. huge. How thick, so how how thick is this, is this tablet? Um, they had this thing on a platform. I mean, it, it was so big, it took up a big, huge chunk in a part of the stand where they put it on. Okay. It's, it's, it's extremely heavy. Okay, and they put this block on there, and of course, because you, you can't, you know, first of all, you cannot touch anything. So right, anything. right. And then like, they don't want any flashes with the camera. So I'm there taking these pictures, and I'm going around these different angles, mm-hmm. trying to get, you know, angle pictures, and I came up with this. But I'm going to tell you, this is the most magnificent piece, one of them, that really uh, jumped out at me, because this is a this is historical showing you how he fought and conquered his enemies. Okay, tell me what this piece is called. If someone wants to go and research this, what is the name of this piece? They didn't have the name okay. on the bottom okay. of it. That's what I was looking for. Okay, they didn't have the name, which kind of you know aggravated me a little bit. Right. Because I'm trying to figure out what where they're coming up with the stone. But of course, I know by reading the, what this actually is interpreting. Which yes. Is, is, yeah, this is the Battle of Kadesh in the 19th Dynasty where he conquered. And of course... Also, the battle with the sea people. They call them the seafaring people, which Seti um, you know, fought. And then, of course, Ramses takes up the mantle and finishes the battle with them. Mm-hmm. 